what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix every kind of uh connection server network issue you're currently having with sea of thieves so stay to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you'll probably know what to do in order to kind of, in order to fix this kind of issues before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work in youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so in order to fix these kind of issues the first step i would recommend doing for everybody is going to be to type on your keyboard so just press the windows key and the r key at the same time and afterwards you should be able to see this tab popping up and what i want you to do is simply just type in cmd and hit enter so once this tab pops up, just type in what I'm going to type in. So ipconfig space slash flush DNS and hit enter. So once it is successfully flushed, you should be able to end this task again. The next step is going to be to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your settings, navigating right into network and internet and clicking onto network and sharing center. Once this tab pops up, I want you to navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto the second link where it says change adapter settings and stick around this tab. So I want you to navigate to the top left corner again and clicking onto the first one which pops up. So this could be either internet or ethernet. This just depends on which one you're using. So right click, disable. Once it is disabled, wait a few seconds and enable it again. This enabling process could take quite a few moments. So just wait, if, uh, wait patiently until it's connected again and once it is connected then you should be able to end this task and return back to your networking sharing center uh, once you return back i want you to navigate onto the blueprint attack so this could be the, could be again either internet or ethernet again click on it uh, once this tab pops up click on properties and double click the internet protocol version 4 but i want you to enable the following dns server addresses and type in the, on the top the Google server addresses, what, what do you want, or it four times eight at the top and two times four and two times eight at the bottom or so on the alternate DNS server. Once you did that, just click OK and apply it and you should be able to have uh, your game running smoothly again. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you guys, but I'm just trying to hear in uh, order to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.